Today I'm going to show you how to download QGIS, type QGIS, and when you type, you can get QGIS, download QGIS tutorial server plugins and like that. So press QGIS download, and there is a site download QGIS, click download QGIS, and always it gives you the current version. Of QGIS, which is now 3.10, it's uh, it was released on 25th of October 2019, and uh, I prefer to download standalone with 64 bit, which is appropriate for my laptop. Click that one when it starts downloading, like this. But I have already tried to download, uh, and uh, I already downloaded one of them. So it gives you a thank you message and donate, and uh, you can close if you don't. Then you go to the place where you download. Here I put I saved the downloaded software in my folder. So double click on it, and click, uh, click, click yes for the message. <coughs> then click next. Then uh, you agree, it's automatic, then next. Then these are the components to install if you want for tutorial. Then I just skip that one install, and it starts to install. And it takes a few minutes to install in your computer. You can read about QGIS, documentation, forward, users, discover QGIS. For example, if you click discover QGIS, you can see QGIS the leading open source disk of GIS to use a professional GIS application that's built on top of and proud to be itself free and open source software. So you can read more about it to get started, the community, features, shop, case studies, supporting organization. You can read about pages from the site, the documentation software. If you want to involve in developing pages, you can click get involved. And uh, this is for users how to download, check out documentations, connect with QGIS community, like that. So I show this to you until it finishes. I think still installing. I normally use ArcGIS and QGIS, but QGIS is free and open for everyone. And I prefer that one instead of buying commercial software like ArcGIS. And this, it is easy to use. Especially, I like the layout of create maps in pages, which is best for publication. Now, 
almost finishing. So there are many documentation that you can find from PG site, PG user guide, training manual, tutorials. You can click many of those. Start learning by yourself. I have also a plan to show you how to add layers and the mapping and some geo processing in QGIS in the future. So here I click finish. Now it's finished. So if you type QGIS and you can get QGIS different version. So this is the versions that I was using. So now the installed one is this one. So QGIS desktop 3.10 with grass. So this is the one, 3.10. And it, they named with different towns in the world. And this version is named, I think, as Akurina. I, I actually don't know where it is. So now gives me some working environments and now I click blank one. So here it is. This is QGIS interface with the new version. Then you can see the, the menus, the new menu. So they, they might be the same with the previous one, but you will feel it when you apply or when you process the data in the new version. You will see also new plugins, additional plugins uh, in the new version. So now this is all about how to download QGIS and install QGIS in your computer in an easy way. So you click exit QGIS then you exit. Thank you for listening. Thank you for listening.